In this video, we will cover everything you need to know about using Siri on your iPhone. So let's get started. Step 1. Setting up Siri To use Siri, you first need to set it up on your iPhone. To do this, go to setting and select Siri and search. And turn on the toggle for listen for Hey Siri. Then activate by follow the instruction. Hey Siri! Hey Siri, send a message. Hey Siri, how's the weather today? Hey Siri, set a timer for 3 minutes. Hey Siri, play some music. After you activate, this allows you to activate Siri hands-free by saying Hey Siri followed by your command. You can also customize your Siri setting by selecting your language, voice, gender, and many many more. Step 2. Using Siri for basic talks. Once you have set up Siri, you can use it for various talks hands-free. For example, you can ask Siri to make a phone call, send a message, or set a reminder. To activate Siri, say Hey Siri followed by your command. For example, say Hey Siri, call Zaid. Hey Siri, call Zaid. Calling Zaid Gontag Mobile. See, like you can see, the Siri will make a phone call to my contact name Zaid to make a phone call. Or maybe I can say, Hey Siri, set a reminder for tomorrow. What do you want to be reminded about? Tomorrow I'm going to meeting. Okay, I added that for tomorrow. This is, we already tried to using Siri for basic talks. On step 3, you can also using Siri for accessibility feature. Siri also has several accessibility features that can make your iPhone experience more accessible. For example, you can use Siri to turn on voiceover, a feature that provides spoken description of everything on your screen, making it easier to navigate. To activate voiceover using Siri, I'm going to say, Hey Siri, turn on voice over. Okay, I turn voice over on. Then the Siri will turn on the voice over function. If you want to turn it off, just say, Hey Siri, turn off voice over. Sorry, I can't help you with that. Hey Siri, turn off voice over. Then, the voiceover setting will be off. Step 4. Using Siri Shortcut Siri Shortcut is a feature that allows you to create custom voice command for tasks you frequently perform on your iPhone. For example, you can create a Siri Shortcut for Order My Favorite Pizza that automatically order your favorite pizza from a nearby restaurant. To create a Siri shortcut, go to the shortcut app and select create shortcut. After that, you follow the prompts to create your custom voice command. Step 5. Using Siri to control smart home devices. If you have smart home devices, you can use Siri to control them hands-free. For example, you can ask Siri to turn on the light or adjust the temperature. To set this up, make sure your smart home devices are compatible with HomeKit, Apple smart home platform. Then add your devices to the home app on your iPhone. Once your devices are set up, you can use Siri to control them hands-free by saying, Hey Siri, turn on the light. That's the sample. That's it for our guide on how to use Siri on your iPhone for hands-free accessibility. Siri can be a powerful tool for making your iPhone experience more convenient and accessible. Whether you'll have limited mobility or just prefer a hands-free approach, 
By following these steps we outline, you can make the most out of Siri on your iPhone. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.